Hi, I'm Laura Kennedy. Thank you so very much for joining us. Today I'm with Ken Lamb, music director for the Illinois Symphony Orchestra, along with ISO principal cello, Norman Zolzaya. Hello, both of you, and thanks so much for joining us. We are talking about the gala that is coming up for the Illinois Symphony Orchestra. That is October 18th at 7 p.m. Symphony in Your Slippers. It's a gala fundraiser, and we're so anxious that you will join us for that. Leading into that will be an extraordinary performance featuring Noman, who will be performing some great classical pieces as part of the Sundays at Six series that the Illinois Symphony Orchestra offers. Now, Ken, could, do you think you could give us a little bit of a, um, a capsule summary of what Sundays at Six series is? Yes, of course. Uh, well, as everyone knows, uh, orchestras have not been giving full-scale public performances since the middle of March this year because of the pandemic. So uh, we at the ISO know that our supporters really wants to uh, hear us and listen to music. So we've created a series called Sunday at Six through, um, you know, people can watch it through Facebook and YouTube uh, and our musicians who are all sort of isolated, you know, at home, they can actually perform uh, an hour, about 45 minutes, and there'll be a question and answer session through Zoom or either through YouTube. And it actually has been very, very popular. And it's something to keep uh, our musicians connected with our community. And uh, I think people have enjoyed it. And we've had a number of, uh, five of them, I think, over the summer. And we've decided to extend the series and have it uh, go on all the way through uh, December. Well, that's fantastic. Well, the one that's going to be coming up on Sunday, uh, October the 18th, uh, we'll be featuring uh, Noman. And Noman, you'll be playing some gorgeous works uh, from, say, from Vivaldi and some other com composers. And I just thought it'd be nice to get a little background on you as well. You'll be playing for audiences um, pretty much here in Bloomington Normal Twin Cities. But you've come a long way uh, to Illinois from your home. You are you were actually a native of Mongolia, and you started actually when you were six years old. Can you tell us about your start as a six-year-old playing the cello? I mean, you were probably not even tall enough to reach the, top of the cello at the age of six. Yes, um, I was actually inspired to play the cello because my mom, she's a violinist in um, Mongolian State Philharmonic. So she really wanted me to play some kind of instrument. And I went to uh, only one music school in Mongolia that my mom went and every other musicians went. And so my sister also went as well. So um, I started there and studied for about 12 years before I got to the States. Yeah. Well, once you got to the States, you started racking up the awards left and right. You uh, are a prize winner from the Rising Star Concerto Competition and also the Mongolian International Music Competition. You were a prize winner twice with that. So we're very honored to have you as a part of the Illinois Symphony Orchestra and performing as part of the uh, Sundays at Six series. Ken, can you tell me what it means to you to have amazing international prize-winning artist like Noman as part of the symphony orchestra? Well, it's of course fantastic. Um, Noman won our audition for Principal Cello at, oh gosh, almost two years ago. And, uh, and we were so impressed. I remember, you know, uh, when we have auditions, we all have to sit behind the curtain and Noman just stood out with her I I incredible musicality. And we were just so blown away by her playing, and and uh, it was it was just really really nice to get to know her because she's a wonderful musician and a really wonderful person, and uh, and we're very uh, blessed at uh, the Illinois Symphony that we have access to a lot of world class musicians who come uh, you know they they live in the states now but they come from all over the world, and. Um, and they, they come and play, and it, it's actually a really, really, really good atmosphere. And um, I, I think we're just so lucky to have somebody like Nobin with us. 
Well, coming up at, for the Sunday at 6 series on uh, October the 18th, uh, Noman, you'll be doing some Antonio Vivaldi, Jean-Baptiste Barrier, am I saying that correctly? Um, also, Gaspar Casado, the suite for violoncello, and you'll do um, something by Alfred Schnitke called Music Nostalgica for violoncello and bass. And I'm thinking anything with a little bit of nostalgia right now is very good for us because let's face it, 2020 has hit us below the belt for a lot of reasons. So tell us how it feels for you, Norman, to be performing again, to have an audience again after having been in lockdown and not being able to participate in the usual concerts that the rest of the concert season was closed and, and shut down in last March. How does it feel for you to be performing again? Yeah, um, that's a good question because before these performances with the ISO, I wasn't really into playing because there was no motivation because no concerts going on. And uh, the fact that ISO is making the musicians to stood out and do it in a way online, it just inspires me, motivates me to perform and I get excited because I have some goal to you know, um, practice and work forward. So I really appreciate the um, this opportunity so much. I so what are you hoping audiences get out of your performance on the 18th? Oh, I hope that they will, do, I will be playing with my husband who's a bass player. So I hope oh. they enjoy the, the bass, you know, bass duets and what bass and cello can, you know, bring out to the audience because one of the reasons I have chosen these pieces is because my husband is a bass player and um, we were able to play the sonatas and um, solo pieces. So I thought it would be a good idea to show it. Well, the fact that you two are married and you have a, a special sort of communication, that must translate really well when you're performing as well. I mean, talking over dinner, that's you know, your casual communication, the, the music communication, it must, uh, must be even more solid because you have your day-to-day -day interpersonal communication. That's right, because we've been really enjoying rehearsing because we have fun. We like to play for fun together and it really brings us together and we we'll try to show what we have in store for the uh, recital, for sure. All right. And and Ken, tell me, what do you hope people get out of the performance coming up on October the 18th, uh, 7 p.m., the Sundays at 6 series? How do you hope audiences react to what you guys have to offer? Well, um, it's an old cliche, but music really brings people together. Even at this time, it brings people together virtually, right? And I, you know, I was in uh, Springfield and Bloomington not so long ago just for to visit and to see people and just to be able to see people and talk to people is so important. And I know I, I, from all the people I've spoken to, they, are, they really want to get back into going to concerts. They really want to go out and have dinner with their friends. They really just want to get together and do the things they, they so enjoy. So this is a small way to remind people that yes, we, we can do some, uh, uh, music making, um, even though virtually the technology is, is wonderful. We actually get a glimpse of, uh, you know, where Nomin lives and, and, uh, I think she has, uh, you know, some, some, some pets. Two <laughs> Siberian cats. <laughs> they will be hanging out in the background. <laughs> <laughs> and also I think this format will also give us an, a, a, a chance to have a, 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 a Q and A session at the end, which has yes. also been really quite wonderful, and uh, yeah, and it's, so I, uh, what we hope is that you know we keep connected with our community, and so when we do come back, you know, I think there'll be such a, an incredible energy uh, with with all the musicians and 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 with the music. Well, it's not to be missed. It's coming up on Sunday, October eighteenth at 7 p.m., the Sundays at 6 series, leading into the Symphony in Your Slippers Gala, the fundraiser for the Illinois Symphony Orchestra, still going strong, still bringing music to people who are in so of need of the music and, and the wonderful feelings that uh, live music gives us. It's like nothing else in the world. 
Thank you so much, Noman and Ken, so much for joining us today. Talk about Sundays at 6 series it's on YouTube, and we hope everyone joins us. Thank you. Thank you.